Hello everyone, peace of Christ to all. No one saw God as he is. This is true, which means God, our God, Father, the Spirit. Nobody saw him as a spirit, except the one who is from the God, which means Jesus Christ. Now let us go and show everybody how Muslims, they do lie about whatever they say. If you go, you will see in many verses in the Bible says that there is many they saw God and they spoke to God and they saw him. But they saw him really in the way he is? No. As example, Abraham, God, he came to him as a man. So he spoke to him, he came to him, he walked in front of him as a man. But this is not how God he is. So God, he can show himself if he want in anything you want. He, he's, he's God, you know, who are you to tell him what you can do? If you want to show himself to me as a, as, a, as, a, as a bird, he can. If you want to show himself to me as a man, he can. It's his choice. He is God. Muslims, they are putting for God what he can do, what he cannot do. And this is, this is proving to us that their God cannot be God. Because they are making a law even for their God. You can do this, you cannot do that. You can do this, you can do that. You know, you, their God is the same as a puppy. And he have a leash. You can do, you cannot do, you can do, you know, we don't have such a God. Our God is not a puppy. And the Bible have a lot of verses showing it clearly that God, he spoke to his prophets and he appeared to them. But nobody saw the real way he is except the one he is coming from him. As in John 1.18 it says, and Jesus says of himself, no one has seen the Father except the one who is from God. Only he has seen the Father, which means, is, you know, this is talking about himself. So, there is many they saw the Father in the way he wanted to appear to them. This is why we saw Jesus. And this is not the way God he is. This is the man. This is God showing his glory to us by a man. But this is now not how he is. This is why Jesus, he said, my Father is greater than me. Because I am in the shape of the man. This way, you know this. Because he's in the shape of the man, he said, he, "You know, my father is a greater than me." And you know, and here you you ask yourself how Jesus is comparing himself to God, even if he is not God. Simply, he is saying to to to, to us as a human that what do you see, of, you know, of me is very little of what I can be, or what I am. You are seeing the man. I am greater than this. I wanted to show myself to you as a man because you need to see me, you need to talk to me. Always you have a wonder in your life, who is God, where is God, how come we don't see him? If God, if God is a true, let him show himself to us. And this is how funny those humans they are. When God, he came to them, they say God cannot be human. At the same time they ask God, can you show yourself for us? Can you prove to us that you are God? Can you prove that you are exist? So when he come and he proved to them that he is exist, he made miracles, he raised people from death. You know, he, he made people cannot walk, walk, make people who cannot see, see. And still they say, oh, you know, come on, he is just doing a miracle of somebody else. This is not his miracle, which is false. In the same time, the Muslims will say to you, People saw Jesus. So what if people saw Jesus? People saw Allah too. Where? I will show you. I have no problem. Here we go. This is chapter 28, verse number 30. Talking about Musa, Musa's, let us read together. But when he came to the fire, a voice was heard from the right bank of the valley, from a tree. In the holy ground, even the ground became holy, which means there is a voice and the holy ground, which means there is a physical existence of God in that location. O Moses, verily I am Allah, the Lord of the world. But who is talking here? Do you see? Hey, Allah. No, 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 listen. Yeah, it's Allah, but it's who is talking? It is the tree. The voice is coming from a tree. Not from between the bushes as the verse in the Bible says. Simply Muhammad, he made the mistake, he copied the verse, but because he's a liar, he have to add, you know, he have to miss up with it. So he said, 
the tree is speaking did you did you watch those magic magic uh, you know uh, kids cartoon when the tree speak here we go the tree is talking saying to Moses, says i am allah so allah did not speak to him by voice without a face he spoke to him as a tree because when the voice is coming from the tree itself not from the bushes it's mean allah became a tree and even the the ground around the tree is holy and you know what if i see a vision if i hear the sound of god is that will make the ground holy it doesn't make sense the ground is holy because there is a physical existence of this god like what about uh, uh, one mile away is it holy no so why this one is holy simply because Allah supposedly became a tree and he's speaking to Moses from the tree so your God Allah the tree who spoke to Moses and Moses saw the tree he was God or not when he was a tree in the same time you will see in the same chapter we are in here in chapter uh, uh, 27 actually verse number 7 you will see in here but when he came to the fire this is Moses a voice was heard blessed are those in the fire and those around and the glory to Allah the Lord of the world Moses verily I am Allah the exalt in might and the wise and here guys you will see a contradiction with the other story because the verse the, the, the verse I showed you the one before this one it's saying that Allah he spoke to Moses from the tree and here Allah is speaking from the fire and this fire is a blast fire and here you ask yourself why a fire is a blast fire it's just a fire blast the fire and bless the one around the fire and Allah speaking from the fire saying I am your God Allah so Allah decide to show himself to, to Moses as a fire this time two minutes ago he was a tree maybe tomorrow he will come as a monkey then they will say to you Moses never saw Allah well, who is speaking to him there then which means Allah he can appear in the way he likes supposedly in the top of all of that <clears throat> why we cannot see Allah who said we cannot see Allah let me expose the lies of Muslims because Muhammad himself he said you will see Allah this is the book of Ibn Kathir I will memorize the, I will make the, the page more clear just wait to show you what I'm talking about here we go as you see this is not our my, my this is not my book this is not me I'm saying that this is Muhammad himself is speaking and this is the book of Ibn Kathir you can go to the website he is saying the day when the the, the, the shin shall lay bare and they will shall be called to protestate protestate themselves but they shall not be able to do so meaning in the day of the judgment and the error earthquake trails etc 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 okay what will happen the prophet saying our Lord he will reveal his shin his shin read with me then you will see then God himself read with me please when the Almighty Lord make himself visible before the believer then the believers will fall down you see it but what they will see on him by the way they will see his leg remember his you know his his shin they will see on him his shin so he will make himself visible so you can see God according to Islam even why they are lying to us in the same time this is very clear hadith hadith number uh, 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 al-bukhari book number he said the people said oh Allah apostle shall we see our Lord in the day of resurrection the Prophet said do you have any difficulty in seeing the moon in a full moon night they said no oh Allah apostle he said do you have difficulty seeing the Sun when there is no cloud they said no oh Allah apostle he said so you will see him so who said no one can see God your prophet he just said you can unless you are accusing your prophet to be a liar 
if you can see him in the judgment day, you can see him today too. You see how we can expose those liars? I will post this link next to the, uh, uh, to the video so you can go all of you guys and you can read it. Christ is Lord and Muslims are a bunch of liars 